Hey everybody, Mike Gray here from DesertJeepRat.com and uh, I got a confession for you. Um, I love taking things apart. I love fixing things. I like getting dirty and getting my hands greasy and uh, really enjoy the process of uh, accomplishment when you build something, tear something apart, put it back together, make it better, improve it, upgrade it. So recently I thought, why, why wouldn't I want to tackle uh, a re-gear in the Blue Burrow, the Jeep? And so I, uh, I set about that and uh, I bought the parts and multiple people said, you really should consider having a shop doing this. It's a more difficult install. Uh, you may get frustrated. Did I listen? No, no, I didn't. I didn't listen at all because I thought I knew it. I thought I could do it. Well, turns out I could do it. Uh, it took twice as long as I would have wanted. Uh, and uh, I got a lot of great information from uh, folks who are professionals that do it. And uh, I uh, would just tell you at this point, unless you're really substantially advanced, and you can put your Jeep on a lift, I would encourage you to pay a professional to do your re-gear. I went from 410 gears in my Rubicon to 488 gears. I was just trying to get uh, the larger tire uh, adjusted to where I had basically stock re-gearing, uh, and uh, it all worked out. Uh, gosh, that the uh, rear carrier, I think I had that in and out 20 times trying to get the shimming uh, right to left done. And uh, there were moments of meltdown and uh, breakdown and throwing things and uh, going for walks, just to clear my head. Uh, but eventually we got it done and uh, I would just encourage you very strongly, consider having a professional do your re-gear. Uh, there's very little I haven't done on a vehicle, motor swaps, all of that kind of thing, but honestly, I think a re-gear is more difficult for me anyway. Uh, what's your experience? Tell me what your experience is and uh, what you experienced in a re-gear, and maybe also, are you as uh, thick-headed and stubborn as I am? Because I find myself in this situation far more often than I would like. But anyway, thank you guys for paying attention. I'll show some videos and uh, uh, some other images of uh, the re-gear on the blog post along with this video. Uh, I hope you enjoy and maybe you learned something from my experience. Uh, pay a professional to have your re-gear done. This is Mike Gray at DesertJeepRat.com. I uh, look forward to uh, new videos coming out soon uh, because uh, I'll uh, show you a hint in the video of uh, something that's coming soon. Thank you.